Well, you know, it, it, we're still in camp mode, even though we just started class the, uh, this past Monday and uh, still working through a lot of uh, teaching stuff that we're doing, you know, in the kicking game, offense, defense, and things like that. So uh, still just been really working on us as much as we can right now before we kind of start our game preparations here uh, uh, starting next week. So uh, j just trying to stay the fundamentals as much as we can, work some things that maybe we won't get a chance to work as the season gets into it. So uh, guys are working hard, pushing through the heat. So that's that's been our biggest challenge right now. You know, the, these freshmen are freshmen for a reason. They don't know where to go and what to do right now, but, uh, you know, those, those guys' leadership is real important for our success. So, uh, just kind of been a challenge for them uh, going through camp of, of setting great examples, uh, you know, and because they were in their same shoes last year. And uh, so they've done a good job of that, and hopefully that'll, that'll continue throughout the season. You know, we've had some good, uh, some guys show really, really good uh, flashes out there. You know, Isaiah Howard, I think he's having a really good camp for us at receiver. Uh, seen him make a lot of plays. Uh, you know, and sometimes it's hard to, you get in the coaching mode a lot of times and you have to kind of sit back and watch, watch your practice film to kind of see who's really doing good. But he's really stood out for us. And Lee Autry's having a really good camp for us. Uh, you know, Kenny Wooten's having a good camp. So there's a lot of individual. Rip Kirk's having a good camp for us. So. You know, there's a lot of individual guys that's done a good job, and uh, we're still trying to get these new guys kind of caught up to where they need to be and get them prepared for uh, about what they're about to experience here in the next two weeks.